Hey guys, here we are on the Minecraft fan server. And, uh, well, Arrow Arrowhood Cobra is going to pay me to build a sand duper. So, here's the payment she sent me. Well, just the stone. I mean, I started throwing other stuff in here. I think I may have already shown off this chest before. But anyway, uh, let's see. Where should I go? It's a little, little hard to navigate right now for no particular reason. Uh, let's see. Man, this storage room looks amazing. Just absolutely amazing. Anyway, let's see. Anyway, I'm done trolling now. Just put our field of vision back down to normal. Okay, so we're back. Don't worry, I didn't flip the thing or anything. I just, um, I turned up the field of vision a lot. And that really makes Minecraft sort of freak out. But that looked pretty cool for a minute there. Hey guys, here we are, and I have been busy. Anyway, y you might be wondering what I've been busy about. Well, well probably not, because you can see it. Anyway, I'm out in the ocean near my city right now. I've been working on this place for a while, I never showed it off in a video, but... Yeah, well, here it is. Basically, there's an ice stream down there, or at least what's going to be an ice stream. Then up here is a... I don't know how you pronounce it, but a terror-esque mob farm. I think that's the way that you say it anyway. Anyway, I will link the video where the video tutorial for how to make this in the video description. And let's see, anything else I should say about it? Well, basically, the mobs spawn in here, they walk off into there, and they get pushed out. And I currently have it as a lava drop setup because in 1.4.4 they they fixed mobs falling onto fences and dying. So that was annoying. I'm pretty sure that's a bug, actually, though. But, you know, I'm not sure. I hope they fix it back, though. That's just a lava blade in there. And so then it's going to drop it down onto a nice stream and take it outside of the loaded chunks. So I can just AFK at the top of this ladder for a couple hours or something. Anyway, that's just what I wanted to show you for right now. And let's... See. I'm always af afraid I'm going to forget to say something important. Anyway... I think that's good. I've got a sand generator working at the uh, down there, so that's where all the sandstone's been coming from. It takes a lot of blocks to build this thing, but thank you to I think his YouTube is T S Terrorontor. So I've been I'm using your design here. Uh, your video link is going to be in the description, and let's see, that's just a little shout out for you. Uh, what should I say next? All right, well I'll fast forward to when this thing is done, or at least more done. Alright, see ya. Well guys, here it is. Finally done. So, here are the spawning pads. You can see it in his uh, video. And then I just lit up the top with torches, made sure everything's good up here. And then I'm just going to go to the top of this ladder, bridge out a little bit, and AFK there. So, close this up. Hope there's no lighting glitches in there. Anyway, I'm going to AFK for a while. I'll start recording again when I go to pick up the drops. So, see you then. Whoops, no, 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 this is not good, this is not good, no! Ah. Oh. Well. At least it's not too far away. Just hope none of my stuff went into the ocean. Alright, well, see you guys. Hello guys, here we are. And this thing is working, sort of. Uh, anyway, I'm going to head on down here. My FPS seems to have dropped a little bit ever since that thing over there loaded. So, let's see what we got here. Just going to run on over. I might need to make a new pathway for this. Not not totally sure. But, yeah, this thing seems like it's working pretty well, right? And I'm not going to jump cut to the end of this thing. Ooh, here we go. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Ooh, that is pretty. Let's see what we... Eh, well, it's only a few entities, but I mean, it's like... Ooh, that looks, that is pretty. That is the prettiest thing I've ever seen. Well, it's not, but you know what I mean. Anyway, let's see. Put this stuff away. Oh, whoops, missed another gunpowder stack there. Okay, now I need another one for arrows. Let's see, I had, an, I had a stack on me, though, so. And is that everything? I think... It is everything. Just making sure. Yes. Yes, it is. 
So I'm happy, it's working. I can now AFK and get all the stuff I ever need. So I'm good. As long as nobody, you know, just sort of sails around here while I'm AFKing. But anyway, that's this episode, at least whatever I'm going to record for right now, that's it. And I might add something else to this episode later, but for right now, I'm, I'm good. So I am going to stop recording for right now, and talk to you guys later. Hello guys, I just went caving, and we got 15 diamond ores here. Counted them all up. Anyway, let's see what we got. One. Yay. One. This is, um... Yep, this is a uh, fortune three pick. Wanted to make sure there. Alright, four. Four again. Not bad. Is that four again? Alright, I'm starting to like his fortune pick a lot better. Alright, three. Two. Alright. One. That's, that's nice. Alright, ooh, four again. One. 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 And, alright, so I got, I more than doubled my diamonds. I guess that's fair. So, let's see, I'm going to go ahead and put this thing, these guys away. That's not bad. That's a reasonable haul for one caving run. Plus I brought in a whole bunch of other stuff. Anyway, that was just a quick little segment. Talk to you later. Hello guys, here we are. Um, I have 10 stacks of gunpowder here, so... Usually I just, you know, make stacks of TNT and then just put them away forever and you guys don't see any of it. But I don't usually get to make two stacks at once. So I'm just going to go ahead and pile this stuff up. Somebody please make a GIF out of this. Or at least, not the part where I mess up, but, you know. Alright, so, two more stacks of TNT. And I actually just, I crafted a stack of TNT off camera today. Just a couple minutes ago, actually. So, that is almost six stacks of TNT. That's pretty good. So, that's just what I wanted to show you. See you later. Guys, here we are. And uh, last night I helped decorate the tree. Uh, we've just constructed this tree. Anyway, uh, this is going to be the end of the episode. This is just going to be a last little segment. I wanted to talk about my channel background. Thank you to Glowstone Filmers for making it for me. Uh, I'm going to link your channel in the description. Thank you, because I mean that the image you made is a lot better than what I was using before. So, big thank you to you. And let's see, anything else? Yeah, we got this Christmas tree now. So I'll just get a back up and get a really nice look at it. Getting a little frame rate issue right now. But there it is. Looks kind of weird, but, you know, I helped make it, so it's, it's good. Alright, so see you guys next time.